You agree with me? We should start in this election cycle and our agenda should be leading our politics instead of politics leading our agenda. So for the AFL-CIO, here is what our agenda is. Sure, we need to raise wages. I'm not talking about just the minimum wage. Yes, we need to raise the minimum wage. We need to raise wages across the board. And that should be our agenda. How do we do that? This is connected to everything. Our wages are going down because of trade. I'm not ever going to call it free trade because free trade was never free for the mill worker in the state. They paid for it with their job. So I'm going to ask you to demand little things in order to raise our wages. Right? We need to let the president know. We need to let our elected officials know. Voting for fast track means divorce. Permanent divorce with the labor movement. Here's why I'm saying this. This Congress could not pass a minimum wage bill without 60 votes. This Congress would not pass unemployment insurance extension without 60 votes. But what they are saying to Fast Track is, let's pass the biggest trade agreement to trade with countries like Vietnam, which have a 75 cents a day wage without having any kind of a debate and straight up 51% vote. If it's gonna take 60 votes to get us our unemployment insurance, it should take more than 60 votes to pass a trade bill. That should be our line. That should be the line that should not be crossed. 